wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Good morning guys, um, it is currently, I don't know if you can see that, 9 o'clock in the morning on the 1st of December, so you all know what that means, vlogmas, um, my other ass kicked me out of bed um, and told me that I need to get up. However, I'm really tired. Um, but this year, um, I've decided I'm going to do Vlogmas and it's going to have a slight twist on it. Um, I have a friend on Twitch who also does YouTube um, and she's called Andy Tams. So once you've watched this video um, and you want to see the other half of the Dear Andy Vlogs, go over and check her channel out. So I'm going to do a Dear Andy, this is how I celebrate Christmas in England and she's going to do Dear Voodoo, this is how I celebrate Christmas in America and hopefully it will give us both an insight into how the others live. Um, I've just got up as I said, I'm going to make myself breakfast, I'm going to start off the month as I mean to go on and I'm going to make myself a healthy cooked breakfast. So I shall do that, then I'm going to jump in the shower, get myself ready, probably do a bit of tidying and then head out. So I shall see you all later. We've got sweet onion ravitas with Poached egg and parsley with, oh, let's say onions then, button mushrooms, fried bacon, raw pepper, and beans. And then I've got a normal glass of lemon and water because I got told, oh, I put too much lemon in that. I got told that if you drink lemon and water while you're eating, it speeds up your metabolism. And then I've got a salted caramel latte in my sassy, classy and a little bit badassy cup. And I'm just watching a bit of Jessica Kelgeron. Um, if any of you don't know who she is, She's an English YouTuber who lives in Brighton, I believe, and she does everything uh, vintage, vintage makeup, um, things like that. She's also part of the LGBT community, um, and I relate to her quite a lot because nothing gets in her way, like nothing. She's partially deaf, she can't walk very much, she was paralysed for two years. And yet she's turned out to be an absolutely stunning um, young woman. So her videos, just every time I watch her, uplift me. They inspire me. And yeah, she's just brought out a, another review to do with Bessie May makeup. So go over and give her a check out. So these are my two advent calendars I've got. I'm hoping to pick up a traditional chocolate one just because they're nice to have. So the first one we've got is the English tea shop advent calendar and each day you get a festive tea. So that's that one and number one, I have to lay it down to do this, Organic herbal tea with cinnamon, chicory, licorice, peppermint, ginger and orange. And then it's called Moroccan Spice. And once you've turned all the boxes over, 
you turn it round and it makes a picture. So I'm just going to open the inside so you can see what the tea bag looks like. This is not very easy to do one handed. YouTubers do make this look easy. So that's what the tea bags look like. You know us English, we love our tea and I especially love my herbal tea. And that's what that looks like. So Day one. So now we've dealt with that one. I'm going to put that to one side. And we are going to deal with this one. This is the Body Shop calendar. So let's find number one and let's see what's inside it. Ah, number one. So number one we have got if you can see that a lip balm now I'm going to put you down for a minute because these are notorious for being pins to get out of so we are back and we have got a mango body shop lip butter now I've had their products before and I quite like their lip butters. I haven't tried the mango scent, so I'm quite interested to try this. However, this is what I am using currently, which is the Body Shop Coconut Hand Cream. And this is to die for. It smells amazing and it makes your hands feel super, super soft. So now I'm fresh out of the shower, so I'm going to go... Get ready, do my makeup and head out because one of my friends has decided to leave something at home so I'm going to go pick that up for him. So guys, I was browsing through Facebook and I thought it would be the perfect way to start off a Vlogmas by showing you this. And this truly spoke out to me. Always appreciate what you have. There is always someone out there who wishes they had what you have. So if you don't have the latest iPhone or you don't have the latest MAC lipstick or I don't know what guys like, the latest car or whatever, be grateful that you have them, the older versions of them things. Because some people just want a hot drink or a warm pasty or a scarf or a hat or something or even a roof over the head for the night. So I just thought I'd show you this. And maybe pause for pause this video for a moment. And think. Am I complaining. About something. That's necessary. Or am I complaining about something that. I'm grateful for. That I already have. That I have people around me that love me. That I have food in my mouth. And I have a roof over my head. And heating. So, yeah, I thought this was the perfect thing to put on the vlog. Just think before complaining, guys. So, this is one of the displays. This house believes. I think it's so cute. And if you look, here, all proceeds go to the neonatal unit at Bradford Royal Infirmary for poorly babies. Which I think is superb. If you just look at some of the details. It just, it looks like a proper house. What does this say? Uh, Dear Santa, I have been a really good girl all year. Mummy and Daddy say I'm a little angel. I help Mummy with the dishes and help Daddy with washing the car. Please may I have a dolly. Oh, that's so sweet. And then I've got all the glass on the ceiling. Oh, my vertical don't do well with this. 
and that's the tree this year. Normally, normally, this tree goes from all the way down there all the way up into that circle there. And it's so tiny this year. Everybody's been complaining about it. I mean, it's pretty, you know. But it's tiny. Look, all the ceilings decorated all the way down. So this is one of our um, main ones. I can't believe it moves. That's so cool. So this is in Bradford Kirgit Centre. <laughs> and then as you go around, you get to the gates, and that's where you exit for Santa. Have you put your name and address on the letter to Santa? Talking letterbox. Oh, and then we've got a wishing well, which is out every year. And the presents. That's so cool. <laughs> and this is where you enter to see Santa. The magical gate and the reindeer. Oh, that's what there must be around there, the reindeer. And the sleigh. We put a lot of thought into it this year. And obviously, you can drop money and make a wish. We sent the sled and the sack of presents and a cute little hedgehog on top and a squirrel. It's so cool this year, but if I go around to the other side, there's been absolute uproar with Kurgit's tree this year. So, Vlogmas Day 1, and the first item in the reverse advent calendar is Hair and Scalp Anti Dandruff Shampoo. So, that's the first item, and as we go along, it'll get bigger and bigger and bigger. Hopefully. Holiday magic is in the air. Spirit of the season everywhere. 